So how is a regular day for foster parents? <laughs> it's not a regular day, I guess is the answer. It's just with any other kids, every day is different. Um, right now, I'm one of the kind of person that has a lot of things going on. So I don't have a particular job. I come from eight till four, five, six. So um, some of the kids I drop off in school, some take the school bus, uh, some go to daycare. And then if we have some appointments, I try to schedule appointments. So like two days a week, that's when we have doctor, therapy, whatever. Um, so I have some days where I can just focus on other things. But kids in foster care takes up a little bit more time than uh, kids not being in foster care. And I think it's because of the trauma that we have to address. And sometimes just loving them is not enough, even though it's a big part of it. So they will have appointments. And the state also require a lot of dental appointments and a lot of checks up, check up at a doctor, especially if they are uh, young kids. So, um, so then... If I, if I have some emails I need to write, if I have to check up on something, follow up, I always do it in the morning because my brain works the best. So then I will send out my emails, things that are irritating me the night before that I need to clear up, f finding out things that's going on with the foster kids, with my, with my businesses, whatever it is, I do that. And then if there's something I need to talk with my agency about, that's a good time to call them. I know they're working. Sorry, that's the life of a foster parents. We got kids everywhere, <laughs> even under the table. <laughs> She's not very old, by the way. Uh, so then it's dinner time. Pick them up, dinner time, homework. Um, and then um, most of the time we'll do bath, we'll do um, quiet time and stuff like that, like any other family do. Routine is definitely an important thing. Uh, that's no different than any other kid needs. Um, and then the only thing that I'll say is really, really different is all the documentation you have to document. If your agency tells you, do you have to document something? You have to do it because it's state required. This is not the agency's kids. It's not your kids. It's the state's kids. So, you need to tell them what's going on. But in the end of the day, it's amazing kids. I would not trade it for anything. And it's the best thing, most fulfilling things. And uh, seeing these kids grow, it's just so good. Don't let paperwork hold you back. You gotta do this. It's so 